Today we're going to have a look at how to remove the front and back tires off a John Deere riding lawnmower. We'll start with the rear tire. First thing to do is jack it up and block it. Doesn't need to be this high just so long as the wheel is clear and it'll turn. Next we want to remove the dust cap. That can prove a little bit difficult at times. Sometimes a two-hand approach will work. If you happen to have a hair dryer in the house, you can use a hair dryer on the hot setting. And that just softens it up and it pops off a little easier. So once we get inside, it's not too difficult. There's this C-ring that holds in this washer and that holds on the tire. So we just need to remove that. You can use a screwdriver and just pull it out. Now you'll notice I have the lawnmower on a piece of plywood so that anything that falls out it doesn't get lost in the grass. Alternately you can use some needle nose pliers just to hold it make sure you don't lose it. Now we remove the washer, set those where you know you can find them. Now we'll remove the tire. This is the back tire and there you can see there's a slot right here. So there's a key that we don't want to lose when we pull this out. So pull it out slowly. Now you can see there it is right there. That's the key. If it's not on your axle and have a look inside and it'll likely still be inside. Depending on your model of John Deere lawnmower, there could be a washer, an additional washer here. Now it might stick to the back of the tire. Check for it because if it's on the back of the tire you don't want to drop it on the ground and lose it in the grass or check that it's there just to make sure. This one doesn't have one. This is a 105. There's no washer on this one. To put the tire back on, before you do, this is optional, but you may want to add a little grease to the shaft just so that the rim won't seize on the shaft. And so now we need to line up. There's a slot here and that's where that key fits in. So when you're putting the tire back on, line that up. Actually, if you seat the key all the way back, make sure it's down. You've got to make sure that that key is seated all the way down. There. Okay, so back on the front side of the tire. Now we need to put the washer back on. Then we need to seat this C-clip. There's a little groove there which should be in front of the washer. So you can place it in. And then your needle nose pliers that you used previously might work to close that in. Or you can use some channel locks or some other pliers. There we go, it's in place. Now we put the dust cap back on now. You can see that, again, we have this washer that's giving us a little bit of trouble but it's no big deal just get it placed on one side and then sort of pucker it in the center work it in there you go now for the front same thing I'm going to block it. Now I know something round is not ideal. If you have something that's squared off, of course that works best, but just making do with what I have handy. As long as the tire is clear and we'll rotate. Next we want to remove the dust cover. You can use the hair dryer if you have to. So again, next we have the C-ring. Put it where you won't lose it. Next, remove the washer. And 
then just remove the tire. And don't go too fast, depending on the model, there, there could be a washer, so always check for the back, see if there's a washer, you don't want to lose it in the grass. This one, we're good. That really is all there is to it. Now, again, before I put it on, I'm just going to put a little bit of grease in there. You can see you can do that uh, right here as well when the wheel is mounted. Put the tire back on. One well greased washer. And then it's just the C ring. Again, in the slot. Use your pliers or your needle nose. Channel lock work nice. There you go. Place the dust cap. Oh, pucker technique. There. Remove the blocking, and we are done. If you'd like to support the creation of more short, concise, well-edited videos, please like, subscribe, leave a comment. Thank you very much. Hope to see you in the next video.